today is a special day, my friends. I'm going to be showing you the first edition of my Kids Lunchbox um, series. This is something that you can find on my blog. So my very first post will be coming out when you see this video. It will already be there, so I will link it in the description box below. I am showing you this. This is a Yum Box. This is what I use for my son's lunch and all the reasons why I can actually be found in that post. So again, just check out in the description box. I'm not going to go into detail here, but check out all the reasons why this is the lunchbox to use for your kids' lunches. Um, and before we get into what I made for the day, let's see what you need for a kid's lunch to be healthy. This plate, I actually grabbed on Amazon. So I will link this below too, because this is super helpful. I know there's a diagram online, you can just print it, but um, I find this extremely helpful just to have on hand for me to make his lunches, but also for him to see like, this is what you should be eating in a day. So we have fruits, uh, vegetables, greens, and proteins. And every single lunch that I show you is definitely going to have all of these um, and in the correct portions. So I hope that you um, enjoy this video. I'm not going to say much more here because you're just going to see, you're going to see what I made this week. And this is a weekly edition. So you will see a different lunch every week. And I hope you really like this because I think it's super important for our kids to stay healthy. So check out everything in my description box so you can find my blog post with all the information. But here is um, a little snapshot of what I made this week for my son's healthy, vegan, budget-friendly lunch. I hope you like it. If you do, hit that like button and make sure you are subscribed to my channel because that's how you're going to get all the latest videos, which I have three videos coming up every single week. One is our grocery haul. Um, you know, I've been doing these $50 challenge grocery hauls. I might be changing that to $60, but it's still a budget and you will see everything that I get to make in my follow-up video, which is a meal prep video. And then you get to see our healthy lunch. So please subscribe to my channel and <laughs> I will see you every week, three Let times a week. Let me show you what I used in my son's lunch for this week. Um, and it goes along with my video, my grocery haul video that I did. I posted it on Monday. So check that video out too if you want some inspiration on what you can buy to make these lunches. But here is everything. Here is my plate to help me figure out what I should be feeding my son. And these are all the portions that I have set aside. So for fruit, um, my son likes all fruits. Um, so you can really, you can do whatever your child likes, but mine prefers um, strawberries. We all know this. Every week I buy strawberries, whether they are frozen or fresh, we always have to get strawberries. So I put a few of those in there and then I added some purple grapes because they looked really great and I figured he would absolutely love those so I gave him a couple of those to go with it I actually just left them right on the stem you know make it easy for yourself don't go don't go too um into creating like pretty <laughs> picturesque um lunches I used to do that I don't do that anymore I just really want to concern myself with the health the overall health of the lunch and making sure that it's something he will eat. So that's what I have for fruit. Then for veggies, again, I'm just going to give him stuff that I know he likes. He likes carrots, he likes peas. So this is what I bulked up the veggie portion with um, because I know he'll eat it. And the other thing that I will mention too is peas can also act as a protein. They have some protein, lots of vegetables have protein in it. I will be discussing a lot of different health benefits of different ingredients in my email. So uh, my newsletter, my newsletter that is in my email. So if you want, you can go over to my blog. It is in the description box and you can go sign up for my newsletter to get some more information about what's healthy, what's not healthy, you know, where, what you're getting from each of these, these, um, foods here. So, but peas do have some protein, so that could actually go into this side too over here. And let's get right into that protein. So I do, you see these, um, sandwich halves here. 
I made my chocolate hazelnut spread. So that's loaded with protein because it's from hazelnut. Um, if you are nut free or your children's, your child's school is nut free, I have another option on my blog. I will actually link that and the hazelnut spread in the description box. But the other one is a sun butter chocolate spread and it's literally delicious. I mean, it tastes like cake frosting, but it's actually healthy. So that can give you your child uh, something to eat for lunch and some protein as well. But yeah, this bread is not my favorite. Um, but it's my son's favor, of course, because it's like a white bread. This is the Tuscan Pond from Trader Joe's. I got it like a few weeks ago. It was in my freezer. I prefer whole grain breads if I'm going to give it to him as, you know, a healthy lunch. But we're not doing this today because I don't I don't have any. But that's okay. <laughs> we'll get some next week. Um, but yeah, that is the bread. So that would we would consider that a grain, but I really wouldn't consider a healthy grain because it's not it's not a whole grain. But um yeah so we have that and let's see inside the sandwich like I said it is loaded with protein because that spread is made of hazelnuts but I also sprinkled some um hemp seeds right on there so it actually has extra added protein to keep him full for as long as possible and I and I did add some little thing of chips these are white corn tortilla chips just to a little bag for a salty snack to go with his sandwich and the last thing is just this um little peanut butter cup here um I forget the brand name of this how do I not remember that's okay <laughs> but it is vegan we got this on Valentine's Day and you know it's still Valentine's Day week it's his birthday week so he can have a little chocolate I guess and that's it that's all we have here for um his lunch but this is a super healthy lunch please check out my blog below is in the description box to get more information about lunches we are going to be doing this every week so you will see this type of video every week and it will also be connected to my blog so please take a look see over there and check it out and please hit the subscribe button so you can see more of these videos i will see you again next week Thank you.